I'm a lovely Gemini. Welcome to your reading. This is a reading for quarter one, January, February and March of 2023. My beautiful soul, we are going to check what are your energies for first three months of this year. January, February, March 2023. And we are going to see how these three months are going to show up for you, what you need to tweak, how you can get the best results of these three months with the divine guidance. So this is Anura from Pinnacle Souls. If you are new to this channel, welcome, welcome. And this channel is all about tapping into the divine guidance and living life to the fullest. So make sure you click that subscribe button right now and turn on the bell icon to get notified with all of my videos which I keep posting almost every single day. And for returning viewers, thank you so much. Thank you for all the love and support that you show to this channel to me. I'm so, so grateful to you all. So without any further ado, let's get into your reading now. Gemini, the message which is coming forth for you is uh, it's okay to ask for help and help is available around you, okay? And at the same time, you have to use your wisdom, whatever learnings you have learned so far in life, that is what is going to help you, okay? And let me get these cards together. Wow. King and the Queen. Wow. Okay. So, when you ask for help, it also shows that you have the strength to accept what is being offered. Okay. The Divine is trying to help you for the prayers which you have been doing so far. But if you are not open to receive, the assistance what the Divine is going to send you will not make any sense to you. So have an open mind to receive whatever is coming forth for you, whether it is in terms of wisdom, clarity or even any kind of assistance that you are seeking. Okay. Even when it comes to abundance, uh, they they are showing that there is a kind of blocked energy of yours which is uh, holding you back from the abundance. Abundance is available for everybody, okay, including you. Yes, including you, it is available. But you need to set a pure intention so that you manifest this abundance into your life wisely to your heart's desire and for the highest good of all. When you ask for help, whether it is angels or universe or divine, whoever you believe in and speak these words of abundance into your life, you're breathing life into these energies. Okay. Wow. Okay. So, the bottom of the deck, what we have is a three of pentacles. It is a clear indication if you can see people coming together. He being assisted with these two people. Okay. He being appreciated by these two people. When you show gratitude and appreciation, definitely help is available around you. Okay. So let's pull some cards from this beautiful divine deck okay wow number 19 and number 16 both are going to be important dates for you in these three months so keep a watch on that you got to listen to your heart okay your heart is saying the answers more in detail that you are seeking your throat is trying to block it but once you awaken this psychic abilities within you tune into this infinite energy there will be a lot of good things which will open up for you okay ascension yes ascension we have two cards of ascension here okay definitely a uh, level up is happening 
if you can see they are saying you need to use expand your psychic gifts you have already received a message to enhance your psychic abilities because that is going to open a gateway for you in these three months okay wow oh let's shuffle one more time for you you should have the courage to ask for help and accept the help why is that you are trying to block this what is causing you to block even if the angels want to help you they require your permission so that you allow them to help and when they help you are able to receive it right Okay, there's one more card. So in the month, this is for the Jan, Feb and I'm going to pull some more cards for March. Jan, it is clearly showing that you need to move forward. You need to have a crossover. Okay, if you can see those wonderful poles, you need to cross that and go on the other side and you are silently trying to move but you are sad about what you have left behind okay what is that you have left behind because you are not asking you are not asking. Why are you not asking? Gemini. Okay, let's see. Bottom of the deck, we have this lover's card. Okay, you need to have a lot of passion in these three months. Passion is going to help you to move forward. Okay. So, you... It looks like you need some sort of clarity when it comes to your um, wealth and prosperity. If you can see these both are queens, okay. One is queen of swords and the other one is queen of pentacles. She is the one, um, I guess, which represents you because of the air sign that you are and she is an earth element uh, wherein you are thinking about how to have this wealth and or how to move forward with this health wealth okay but there is an ascension which is happening they are asking you to raise above go beyond than what you are currently doing see you are moving a couple of steps and you're halting or you're pausing and again it looks like you are being dragged you uh, know uh, dragged behind <laughs> okay so if you're feeling that kind of energy you need to listen to your heart more and <clears throat> fine polish your psychic abilities that is going to help you to understand exactly what is uh, happening in your surroundings and even when it comes to your <clears throat> uh, subconscious uh, mind I can see there is a lot of uh, disturbance which is uh, showing up okay all you need to do is this is a period of transformation because if you see the center of your reading is the death card and the high priestess card okay you need to learn uh, something which you already know but you feel like i'm not very sure if that is the one and you are not able to use that and that is causing you a kind of um, you know you, you don't want to move forward you don't want to move forward but you need to stand your ground and start taking action only then things are going to change okay in the month of february you have to 
work with the universe the team work remember this take assistance from the divine if you do not want to ask assistance from others it's totally fine take the help of the divine and whatever the divine is trying to assist you with take it and move with it run with it you got to run with it okay and more than anything else i can see this is nine of wands and there is ten of wands unnecessarily you are feeling like you are overburdening yourself you are taking on too much on yourself but the cycle needs to end okay in the month of february they are clearly showing that the cycle needs to end and you exactly know what it is but you are not very sure you want this to be validated from someone else and then only you are ready for this change and you will listen what you need to do from the other person and you will start working on this you will start working on this but however because there will be too many things on your plate you will feel like you know you will be juggling too much you will be feeling like you are overburdened but you need to become more and more disciplined disciplinary with your actions with your daily routine you need to take action action is required if you can see both are king of swords in the month of february and in the month of march both of the time you need to take action this is a month these three months you need to take a lot of actions my love okay be disciplined have a routine follow a routine expand your psychic abilities that is going to help you to open up and become a transformation okay if you feel like you're not sure what to do you are just rushing through activities like you know you just want to finish it but nothing is going to work because you are not able to see things clearly you have to use your wisdom if you remember the very first message before the reading started they said you have to use your wisdom you need to take help from the divine and then only you will be able to nurture this element of money and that's how you'll grow entire three months help is available only thing is you need to understand that everything is uh, easier when it is done collectively okay you cannot manage things all alone in these three months so take help whether it is from a person or whether it is from the divine take help you need to open be open to receive help and then only help is going to show up and that is going to see it's going to help you elevate okay it is going to bring you clarity it is going to um, transform you change your world it is going to put you in in the right action place but if in case if you resist this help then things are going to be very very difficult for you. you you will feel overburdened it is not that you cannot do you are definitely capable but you will feel overburdened stressed out burnt no unable to um, go for a long run okay so let's see what else is coming forth for you and you are your words your throat they are literally showing that the words you are using is not helping you you need to shift your words use positive words use optimistic words don't curse yourself for anything even others as well yeah whatever you are thinking in the month of january that needs to be changed if you can see very very clearly they are saying there is something better for you there is something better for you in the month of january 
how whatever you are thinking it's unlikely to happen and you need to reconsider whatever you are doing in the month of february and in the month of march you need to learn to let go let go that's how you are going to come back into balance okay take the help of the divine when the divine is ready to help you you need to use that magic you need to use that wisdom okay if you feel like you need in detail reading do book your reading go to description box below and book your reading but all i can say for general reading is help is around you you need to work in a team and then only you will see a lot of success otherwise you will feel like you're overburdened okay and the second thing is you need to connect to the divine you need to be open to receive help from the divine the divine is trying to send someone or give some ideas wherein how you your life can become more meaningful and easy but if you block it it's going to be stressful you will be just taking action action and what if if it is a wrong direction right you it would be good to take action in the right direction rather than otherwise so take the guidance as it resonates with you and leave the rest behind and if you need a detailed reading do check the website and book your reading okay with that being said my love gemini know that help is available and you have the wisdom only thing is you need to set up your intention and ask for the help and once the help comes you need to be open to receive this help and you need to speak words of abundance into your life and listen to your heart okay my love i can literally feel angels presence here at this point in time and i call upon all the angels who can help you guide you to have better and wonderful quarter 1 of 2023 okay my love gemini i'm sure you must have resonated with the reading take whatever resonates for you and leave the rest behind and incorporate them into your daily life and see a magical shift or turn around okay and if you have not yet checked the 2023 readings which i have already posted even that is going to you know uh, help you to decide how you can take this uh, year forward okay do check those readings if you have not checked there is yearly 2023 reading for uh, general reading and as well as money reading divine angels reading whatever you want to check there are a lot of content on the channel do go ahead and check because all this is going to help you to have a beautiful life to create a road map okay and have the best of it okay my love without uh, taking much of your time thank you for being here thank you for staying till the end and if you have not yet clicked on the subscribe now is the time go ahead and click on the subscribe button i'm gonna see you soon in other readings till then take care and bye bye my love